What up, YouTube? It's Rod Dog 313. I'm hungry. My son hungry. We're about to die over here if we don't get nothing to eat, so we're about to get ready to go find something to eat, man. Something at a nice value. I feel like eating something I haven't ate in a while. I don't know. I got to stop at the ATM first, grab some money, and see what we're going to uh, try to attempt to get. Hope it's something out there good. Hope it ain't too crowded. And I hope the streets ain't too crazy, man. I don't know. This song come out in Detroit. People act like they don't know how to act, man. It's ridiculous. Okay, so I'm going to see y'all in a minute. And I guess when we pull up and we decide what we're going to eat, we'll go ahead and let y'all know. So, we decided to get something nice, quick, and easy, man. So, we up here at Taco Bell. We like about four cars or something in front of us. You know, it's something a little different than what we eat and stuff. You know, Mom, she went on a little trip, little Merle girl. So, she ain't around. So, we forced to eat off the streets. So, we're about to see what they got on this menu, man. And uh, we'll be back. Thank you for choosing Taco Bell. How may I help you? Hey, do you guys got some kind of uh, builders? Uh, I can build my own stuff or something like that for $25? What? You talking about the taco bar? Yeah, the taco bar. Yes, we do. And what comes with that? I don't have a clue. I ain't never run it up before. <laughs> it comes with two bowls of beans, two bowls of beef, a box of shells, a bag of chips, two bowls of dark chocolate cheese, two bowls of sour cream, two bowls of tomatoes, two bowls of cheese, and two bowls of lettuce. Okay, let me try that. Let me try that. It's, and what is it called again? Uh, taco, oh, at home taco bar. At home taco bar? Yep. Okay, and let me try uh, your uh, crazy pack of tacos and burritos. Okay, and would you like to eat some? Uh, yeah, I want. Yeah, I like. I like I'm y'all. I'm just gonna mix it. Okay, thank you. Anything else, sir? No, that'll be it. Thirty-seven ten. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. Okay, y'all. So I ordered the taco bar, which means you can make up what you want, or I guess, or something like that. I never ordered it before, but I'm giving it a try. And I bought some extra tacos and burritos for our guests later on so we ain't gotta go nowhere or that's what the microwave for. Use it, uh, try to get something, use it tomorrow or something, a couple of pieces or burrito or taco. But uh, I'm about to get ready to, I got what? One, two, two cars in front of me. Yeah, so like I said, we just trying something different. And uh, I'll get back with y'all, and I should have ordered something to drink, but I guess we got stuff to drink at the house, right? Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, so I'll get back with y'all when we get back home, and we're going to see what that taco bar consists of and what's going on with it. Huh. Hey, hey, I see I'm looking at the customer in front of me. I guess they practicing this social distancing so I gonna have to put my money in a cup and I see they giving you your order in a bucket so I haven't been at no fast foods in a while like that really not too much of a fast food either but like I say we ain't got no choice it's too hot to be cooking at home right now so we're about to pull up and see how they doing this you know cuz uh, I don't know what they doing they halfway want us to be out in public and they halfway still practice all this social distancing. So evidently something's working. And I keep looking at these little freezies or something. I might order those. I don't know. 
But Zeke said we got stuff at home, so I could probably just get what I want to get from the house. And now, yeah, they uh, got a bigger bucket where they giving you your order. And all your little condiments and stuff, so. I guess the social distancing stuff is working if that's what caused the virus to spread, you know, rapidly. But here we go, about to get ready to uh, pay for my order, y'all. So bear with me and uh, we'll see how this all gonna go and work out. How much y'all freezy things? Um, what kind you got? You want one? Yeah. I want strawberry. Yeah, I want to add that. Strawberry and what you want? The B word. Uh, uh, what else you say you got? Strawberry and uh, Bahama Blast. Bahama Blast? Let me get that then too. Yeah, I want the strawberry and the Bahama Blast. Hi. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm. Uh, I gotta put my money in the cup, y'all. I feel like I'm giving to the bombs out in the street or something. Yeah, I guess we'll try out these freezy things too, man. It ain't nothing like my beer, but I'll give it a try, y'all. She making them look like she making them with slush and some um, artificial coloring or something like that, but they look nice. What is it? It's 85 degrees out here right now. Still a little humid. Rain earlier today, but now I'm looking, it's not a cloud in the sky. Hope y'all enjoyed our last video, uh, Nene Party. We had a good time. It was fireworks, but I couldn't record it because it was raining. And I didn't want my uh, phone or my device out there in the rain. And I've been looking at a couple of cameras, so I need to decide on which one I'm going to use to start shooting my vlog. So y'all give me a couple of comments and let me know what cameras do y'all think are good for vlogging. I've been looking at Canon and all of those, so let me know and give me a shout out. Okay. It doesn't matter. I can't chew on it. All right. Usually I get receipts too also. Uh, for my vlogging, you know, because it's all a tax write-off, you know, when you vlog and you spend money for this particular expense. But I'm not pressed about it. Like I said, it's the first time, and um, we're going to give it a try. But she asked me, do I want a receipt? And my instinct said no, so I might just ask her to see if it's still available. If it's not, I'm not gonna worry about it because it's always good, like I said, to keep your receipt, especially if you vlogging.
And I was just about to turn the corner to get ready to talk to the lady on the menu. And another driver just cut off right there. I almost had an accident by uh, coming out the blind side. And I'm just trying to place an order and I could have had an accident that quick from somebody who's just driving, I don't know, erratically or something like that. But they just came out of nowhere flying around the corner. That's why, I, I, you know, I try to stay in as much as possible because I don't know, people just ain't courteous or respectful like you used to be there in the day. And we real timing it just to see how long the order takes. You know, y'all like, Rob, dog, we don't want to see you sitting here, man, ordering, you know. But, hey, this is the day in the life of a vlogger, baby. Just what we do. Skills, man. Hey, hey. I guess you can't hear me be, be, be behind the glass. I just had a quick Hi. question. Oh, what up, bro? How you doing, bro? Thanks, mate. That's good, bro. I'm Oh, okay. Yeah. Hey. Is that receipt still available? Is that receipt still available or is it too late? It's too late. Okay, thank you anyway. Well, I gave it a try. Zeke Zeke got friends up here. Zeke Zeke can work somewhere right now, but I guess his mother don't want him to, man, because of this uh, situation out here. It's the first act. Okay. Just gonna put that to the side. That's right there. Alright, that's it. More coming. Hey, we look like we got groceries from Taco Bell. It's a lot of stuff. I didn't predict it that it'd be this much stuff. Okay, this is it. All right, thank you so much. Yep. Yep. It's a beautiful day out there, man. Golden skies, nice and clear. <clears throat> but uh, we got a lot of stuff here, man. So Zeke, Zeke, let's see what we got, man. Seems like some nacho cheese or something right here. This is from the beef, taco beef. Another thing of taco beef. See it almost partially open. The bag is down, but I guess when I tried to open the boat, it's still good and nothing leaked out. I got this one, Chris, I got a big burrito there, a whole bunch of condiments. Got cheese, got lettuce. They got deep, deep more lettuce. lettuce. Three different types of hot sauces. It's hot, it's fire, and then it's um, Diablo. What's in the box? Okay, we got in the box, we got taco shells and burrito wraps. Small burrito wraps. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And how many tacos? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve tacos. And this, we just got all, all chips. All tortilla chips. All chips? Uh -huh. Oh, that's a bag full of chips. What the heck? A bag full of chips, man. She did say that that we were going to receive that, so. Okay, here's something else. I don't know. I'm going to have to open this. I don't see what it is. I don't know still what it is. Uh, what you think it is? That's, uh, I know what it is. Oh. I don't know what it's called, though. I don't know, it's a different kind of meat. And we got your sour cream and we got our tomatoes chopped up. So I guess that's what consists of the um, the bar. This is all right here, in, in, this bag, in all of this right here, plus the chips, this is the bar for $25 right here, build your own. Like you said, you got two lettuces. The mystery meat. Zeke, Zeke said he know what it is. You got your sour cream. You got your tomatoes. You got one one uh, helping of cheese, and you got two of the two helpings of the taco meat. And this is nacho right here, like I said. So this is what comes with it. This is all what comes with it, and the chips. Look like some white Doritos or something like that. And then this bag right here, this bag is the, is the crazy pack. You got you got the um, soft, the soft Doritos, and then on the other side, you got your little hard tacos. And then like a bag, a bag full of um, condiments. Yeah, condiments. So we're gonna sit down and um, I guess build our own right quick and let you see exactly how this works. But uh, the experience, is it worth $25? We're about to see. Um, we need a fork or something, man. A spoon or something. They haven't got one in the bag. Uh, build your own, I threw away the bags. So one thing I see the flaw is y'all haven't got a spoon, a fork or nothing. So I guess if you out on the road or, or they made a mistake or asking for one, but like I said, I never ordered this before, so I didn't know to ask for a spoon or something like that. So I'm just opening up everything right now. I like it in these containers because you can get whatever you're going to get, little uh, portions, and then you can seal it right back up. Got your lettuce. And I would still like to know what that mystery meat is. I'm not going to open up this taco uh, sauce until we need it. I mean the taco meat. Okay, the mystery meat. I don't know what it is. But here we go. I'm about to build me a, um, a burrito, I guess. I'm going to build me a little burrito first. Or a taco burrito. Put a little bit of that up in there. A little bit of lettuce. Some tomatoes. And hand me some of that sauce, Zeke Zeke. Sour cream. I mean, I like them all. I'm not picky about uh, what they serve. I just don't know what that meat is up there. There you go, I got mine built. Oh, a little bit of cheese. Can't forget the cheese. 
って、まずね。I know what that is. It's refried beans. Yeah, that's yeah, that's、exactly. okay. That's what it is. So let me put a little bit of that on there, cause I'm over here looking at it and I'm smelling it, and I just you know remember what it what it is. Refried beans. There you go. Okay. Y'all can see that. Build your own. Put my sauce on there already. Let's see what it's like. I'm in mean, doubt. Can nobody see? Ooh. I guess you're building this yourself. You can't complain because you you made it yourself. They just provided the items, but it tastes good. Taco Bell, no matter what, they still doing it. I haven't had Taco Bell in years. And these freeze things gave me a、um, head rush, so they're pretty cold. Man, I'm good. Like he said, you you can't too much complain about how it is because you literally made it.、Mm -hmm. Okay, let's try a taco. One spoon. I love those refried beans. They should have actually put more up in there. They put a little cup. But they give you two helpings of the meat. The nachos, I would assume, are for the、uh, chips. I'm not too much of a fan for the chips, so Zeke can have that. I ain't never played with Xbox or something. He can knock those down. Been years since I've been at Taco Bell. Like I said, I'm not、uh, a fast food fan too much. I do it for you guys, you know, just to review a couple of things. What is this one, Diablo? So I had the fire. Which I、um, don't see as fire, and it's not hot or nothing like that. But this is the Diablo, so I'm gonna try that. Here you go, homemade taco from Taco Bell. Mmm. You try out the tacos. I try out the nachos. Okay, now we got the chips. Uh, got some meat. Y'all comment. What is your favorite fast food? Like your favorite restaurant to eat at? Especially if you want something quick and easy. I mean, we pulled up. It was like about seven people in front of us, seven to eight. And then we noticed the more we kept pulling up, the more people came behind us. So lately, the last couple of weeks. I've been driving by some fast food. It was like 
every place is packed. Especially the Coney Islands in Detroit at night. Man, it's ridiculous at night. How many cars hanging outside on the street to get inside? But I guess that's what it is. It's too hot. Nobody want to cook right now, and everybody's at the restaurant. We're listening to a lot of noises out here, man. It's like it's been 4th of July for the last couple of weeks. I mean, they've been setting them off, like, ridiculously. Like, it's really the whole month of June we've been hearing fireworks. And look, this Diablo, man, this, now this is kind of hot. Diablo, Diablo, problem solved. You got the one that says fire, and I ain't really noticed anything. But this Diablo, it's, the sauce is kind of hot. Tastes good. What time was that? Bahama. Bahama Blast. And I got strawberry. Okay, you guys. Just go over it right quick. In the bag over there. We got. What was that one? The chocolate and burrito tray case. Yep. They burritos. We got to give you four burritos. And four tacos. There's the tacos. And those are $10. So that's a good combination. Good part for $10. If you're not big eaters, two people can share that. Two burritos, two tacos. And those are really good for the kids. And we'll separate that. You know, if you got about three or four kids, you know, you get a taco and a burrito a piece. Depending on your appetite. But here got a review. To me, I'm pleased for my $25. So far, he ate nachos. You ate a burrito. Uh -huh. I ate a burrito. It's still a piece right here, but I ate a taco. And we got a lot more. So it's worth the value of what you're getting. Well, like you said, you got the two lettuce, got the two taco meats, you got your refried beans, tomatoes, sour cream, and you got your cheese. And you got your um, soft shell or uh, tacos, or you can call them uh, soft shell burritos, but, but whatever, small boys, and you got 12 tacos. So it's good bang for your buck. But we ain't going to hold y'all up no longer. We're about to get ready to go off camera and pig out. We might get a loaf of bread and fold it up and chew it in that. But I'm just playing with y'all. Okay. We're about to get ready to uh, chill out. Let Zeke Zeke do his thing. And I'm going to get to edit in this video. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Love y'all. Peace and love.